things we do hear about air tents is obviously the concerns that people have about air, okay? Uh, so, all of those concerns really are unfounded. So the first one is uh, overinflation with the pump. Now, there is a gauge on the pump, but that's really about protecting the pump. You'd be very hard pressed to be able to overinflate these poles. I think the pump would break long before you could overinflate these poles. I think your arms would be sore. So, look, it just doesn't happen. Uh, so there's no popping as such. Uh, the next one is punctures. So again, it's just not a concern. So to start with, you've got a puncture resistant material here. Then you've got a puncture resistant material here. Then on the inside of that, it's like a heavy duty tarp. So the only way you could really puncture a pole is on purpose. And then you can break any pole on purpose, all right? They are very stable in the wind is the next one. People get concerned about their stability in the wind. It's actually quite windy outside today. You can see this pole is not even moving at all, okay? They're very, very robust. This tent is not even guy roped out, okay? The next one is, uh, look, the other benefits of air is that, you know, if someone runs into it, if you've got the kids or someone's maybe had a few too many, uh, you know, if they do run into a pole, uh, you know, they're very flexible. So, uh, you know, that's just not a concern. They're great for that. Obviously, if that was a solid pole, you've got a broken pole and you have to start over. Particularly in storms, if you get those flash storms, uh, you know, whole campsites will be laid waste to. Even if your tent comes down a bit because of the storm, when it's over, you're camping, everyone's up, it's packing up and going home because their tents are uh, a big wasteland. So, um, they're very, very robust.